I will fight to my last breath. Oh, they get Rhaegar away from us. Okay, so now they got good wave clear. They do have double support. Uh, to run this fairly damagey support. Uther. Now there's a hero I haven't seen in a long time. It's not all bad though, but I do think Brightwing is better. I like Brightwing here. Time. Uther, for some reason, he doesn't see any play any anywhere anymore. Because I really think we are in the sustained damage meta, and I love it. It's it's the most fun games in Hero League and in competitive that I've ever seen. Sustained damage, in my opinion, is where uh, the game should be. The protection against burst is so important to balance the game and to draw out the fights a bit, which is far more watchable for me and playable. Always loved the game, but I like it even more now. That's why, actually, I'm super glad that Medivh is in the game. I thought Force of Will was going to be stupidly broken. But the way that his Q works, it's fairly mana intensive. You can always tune him down if, ne if need be. But Force of Will, I think it's so like fun you. that it exists. It it's it, 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 it's like the counter to burst. The and now you have all these supports like Mouth, Brightwing, being on top of the hill. Even Morales is valid. You have uh, Lunara rising to the top. Nazebo's pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna go for Sieging Wrath, the classical pick four, these days. Three, Best two, map for Medivh and White? Um, I think Dragonshire is a really good one what for him. For? Dragonshire, uh, Braxis holdout. <laughs> Asmodan is a mini soft counter to uh, to uh, Liming because you've got Demon Warriors. And they can block some skill shots like Arcane Orb and so on. So generally you want to put the General of Hell, generally, <laughs> you want to put the General of Hell in a lane where you don't mind it being pushed. If you have a team that is looking for ganks like Sitch's Brightwing, you don't want to put General of Hell there because it's going to push the minion wave in the opposite direction of the enemy lane. And as a result, it will make it far harder to gank them. Because they'll be so far back, they can soak it really safely. Gregor nearly died. First stack in the game hype. Nice. Taking this into overtime. Gonna go get some mana before I can't afford to anymore. Twelve. Go army of hell. We have a small window to cap the siege camp before the opponent, uh, before the tribute will spawn. Gather tribute. Very small. Not the ideal location. We could just cap it later. Still a nice distraction, I guess. Make sure to get those mean Osmo autos in. You're 
stacks. Tracer strong at the moment. Uh, she's very strong in specifically, uh, specifically if you take her with Trace uh, with Tassadar. But generally, she's really not bad. Always contest. thinking about Minion or Infernal Globe. Mostly people go Infernal Globe, but I swear by Bound Minion. But I don't have to pick it until my cooldown of General Hell is back. There's no reason to. It makes it easier for them to dodge, I guess. I think Bound Minion does a lot. Nara. Wow. I guess he bought time then. That's pretty good. It's worth it. Get the tribute. If you nearly killed someone, of course, you didn't mean for that to happen. Only Tychus can kill me. That's like you got some good damage. forward. I'm gonna throw it here because it will cancel the heal ward anyway. Burning warriors with the laser. Hey, Josh, Stone, what's up, dude? Seven more, and then I get the bo uh, the bonus damage, as well as the range. And I have to choose Blackpool or Demonic Invasion. I like the long version. I am a demon. You can't split soak as much with your Q, but it's really good for uh, split push. Non-stop split push. Hey, thanks for the Twitch, 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 Twine, Twitch Prime. Uh, what's up, Papa Donovan? Nice, we got the curse. This one is gonna wreck them. Once he My kills the giant. Your enemies shall fall.
Feels good, man. <laughs> It's okay. Let's go, is he? I go for Hellforged armor. <laughs> I had fun. <laughs> Keep back doors. All good, my brother. Following you since Warcraft 3, but not on all accounts as I can see. Pleasure to see you on a different game, Warcraft 3 too. Thanks, lad. Making a break. That's some kamikaze pro status. That's, that's my Asmo play, man. It's uh It's pretty funny. It's effective. Some burning rage here. Oh, we got the boss. Oh, they have to defend it, huh? Okay, I got this. Oh, come on, I was just getting into it. Ban me and Kata. Hey, this isn't uh, Korean Super League Finals. You don't generally get a boss at level 14 and end with it. Two more of my Seizing Wrath completes. Look at the core! See you guys. <laughs> So good. I need a faster entrance. Bound me. <laughs> let's uh, let's backdoor that shit. Let me go battle war. <laughs> there we go. Bound minion catapult. Here we go. Four percent. <laughs> One hit! Baby Raj! Shall we see who gathers Good stuff. this time? Just keep bound minioning the catapult and see how fast you can burn through it. I think they're worried about it. As well they should be. Just distract them somewhere else and then... Wow! I've never thrown a uh, demonic invasion on a gorge follow up, but I like it. What's better, Dragon Laser Trail or Asthma Laser?
Feels Azumadon, man. Just get camps everywhere. Castle fight? Way too into castle fight. That sounds fun. That sounds like a game I would have played. No Look at that burning rage demon warrior. He's wrecking the wave. Just use the phantom, he's like don't hearthstone. I understand. This is curse tribute. Everyone's gonna go for the curse tribute, right? You gotta, I mean you have to go for it. I should go for the curse, right? To help the team? To make sure that we don't get cursed? Shouldn't I? Should I go help with the uh, with the curse? You get the curse, then you win the game, right? <laughs> Was there any question? Was there any question that, that was gonna work? MVP. Really? Thanks, guys. That was a thing of beauty. It's a very mechanically demanding build and hero. That's why I like him. With my 12 years of pro gaming experience in RTSs, where micro and macro were essential skills, I have finally gravitated towards this. The most mechanically demanding, not just Heroes of the Storm character, but MOBA character in general. Every 30 seconds you need to summon a General of Hell, and then you bum rush keeps and forts, and then finally you bum rush the core. And there's a lot of knowledge too. Do you bat minion the footman, the archer, or the catapult? Well, first the footman, then the catapult. Uh, no wizard, and archer is right at. Talent build is Sieging Wrath. Army of Hell, Bound Minion. You can go Blackpool, but I like Blackpool with Infernal Globe. I like Bound Minion with uh, Demonic Invasion. Hellforged Armor, uh, and then Battleborn. And at level 20, you get Forced Recruitment. You get 10 seconds off the cooldown of your general, and you get a second charge. You push every lane so crazy. Good stuff. No, 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 no. Swift heroes Prime his passive to get a W, so you don't need to rely on that. Before you. Symbiotic link established. Alright, images. You improved. Death to all who serve the grave keeper. I will be like done. Let the grave keeper know my power. Walk. Yes, slay them.